His Grace and Mercy School is an independent Christian preschool located on the Tisha Sanctuary Road close to the last stop. Currently accommodating boys and girls aged 1 to 5 years, His Grace and Mercy School stands for a solid foundation and education, yet preserving the importance of a happy and memorable childhood which is never to be forgotten. On account of its 10th anniversary, we go all the way back to how it all began. When I came home from prison, from the state of the school. So I've been there, I was supposed to, I've been there for some months. And I thought it wise to shut it down. But then I had two stores here. And then we have to turn the two stores into a school. So we moved them the hall to all the school. This is the, these are the two uh, stores that were converted into the first class. That's the first class with this and that. That's where she started from, from the hall to the store. This store and that one were both converted to classrooms. Then we were stuck from two and became stuck. And moved to this place with one teacher and then myself. I was catering for the kids. The teacher was teaching them. From sister, the mama went up to Eleven. We got another teacher, and then another teacher. So I was purchasing, doing the rounds, and then the two teachers and me, they were also helping me to all the things. So for some months, we were about 16 to 20. And gradually, 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 I started another class and I was down block. And we were going, going. And another one, and we went to this side. Now we have over, we have 11 class. Yes, we have crash. And then next week, and then in that we won. We start with one year second year. So the pipeline, everything is set. This um, leather kits uh, that are fresh. That are measure land. This sampler measure one eight. That's really class. Measure one B. That's a point. That's a This is big one, our new block. Everything in our mouth, and when you speak out, it works. 
So I thought it wise to speak those things into the lives of these little children. They will grow to be big. They will grow to be mighty men and women in this nation and then even outside. All the southern has to mold these children in the fear of the Lord. And so I know they are going on or they are being firm in the Lord. That's why everything that we teach them, they also catch it. So when they leave here and even they go to another country, they, they perform well, they do well. When it comes to academics, his grace and mercy school is the best. Going to other schools, instead of them going to, let's say, KG 2 to class 1, we promote them to class 2. We have two head teachers, a head teacher and a head mistress. And then we have teaching staff, a twelve, and then I'm teaching some part of teacher one. It's been five years now and since I started teaching in the grace and mercy school. Bringing your word to his grace and mercy school, you will never regret it. We improved both in academics and then playing, teaching the kids how to speak good English. Yeah, last year, for instance, we competed with Montezuma schools. We were second in the district. We introduced using last year. And I would say it's, it's running in the very best. Bringing your word to this place and mercy. I would say you will not regret it compared to other schools. Yes. Because we have so many activities that run in the place and mercy. We talk of the youth in us. We talk of our cultural performances, our academics. It's not only academics that build the child, but other activities also build the children. performances was it was good though but we had to run programs for teachers and then to do that teachers were in teaching the kids and then having more time for the teachers we had this selective time with uh, the kids which we implemented and then we realized it was working so well kids came from other schools and their performances were very bad some couldn't hold pencils some couldn't they couldn't write and then at the end of the day we realized that they were writing to the extent that a kid from kids from KG2 graduate and they go to class two. It's 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 rare. Yeah, it's rare. But at the end of the day, they go to class two to the glory of God. So we see that it's the tireless efforts of our cherished teachers who work hard, so hard to make sure to meet um, the needs of the kids and so um, at the end of the day all that we look for is to move ahead to do more things to learn more things to run more programs to to enlighten the kids to get to the level that we want them to go to and so now we say the glory goes to god 
and then the higher we go the higher god will send us so we will decrease for god to increase in our life that is his grace and mercy and so we are grateful to god From a class of two children in her hall to its current state, this is what the Lord has done at His Grace and Mercy School International. God bless you for watching. Stay blessed.